welcome friends so today we will talk about uh, how to write xml file using boost library so earlier i had talked about uh, how to write, uh, read uh, xml file from boost library now i will we will talk about how to write it uh, means via uh, boost library uh, the xml file so let's start the main program so uh, means i have already declared all the header file which is required uh, to use the xml uh, apis of boost so uh, let's start so first i will uh, you know uh, create an xml element class name so uh, means i will declare a three member variable which will be uh, of any type uh, this is int with one uh, mid1 mid2 and then uh, int Three. Now I will uh, means uh, create a, a default constructor first. So uh, the default uh, constructor has been created. Now I will uh, create a parameterized constructor. So where I will initialize all these attribute. Now I will be using the initializer list. I will initialize those. So that's it. We are done with our uh, XML element class. So uh, so now let's start with our program. So first I will create an object of that class which is an XML element. So uh, I have used an uh, object array and I will initialize uh, three object here. I will pass three argument here and the same way I will uh, initialize the uh, other three so I'll change that value So uh, we have created uh, three object here. So uh, now let's uh, create an XML uh, file. So uh, we have to means uh, call this object of P3 and then uh, now let's uh, do this. Let's create a uh, child as well and we'll name it as my child. Now I will run a loop on that object. In that loop, I will create a child and we'll add in an object of my child. Let's create that child. I will use the function add and we will add this so better we will use this id1 and then this is my object i and we will call mid1 of the child so the same way i will create three uh, tags which is id1 id2 and ID three. So 
So I'll change its name. Okay. Then uh, we have created a child and we will add it in our initial created uh, MyPT which is a XML you know tree. We will call method and add child and uh, and then we will use uh, we will add it inside the tag XML element and then this my child. This is very important. We have to uh, also clear the values. Now, once we have done this, we will uh, means we will uh, write seven and the name will be my file dot and we will add my pt the tree structure here and that's it we are done so let's compile this program so this is compiling you see it's compiled now uh, let's see the file. This is the file my file.xml. So you see that there is a tag uh, graphic, then x an element, and these are the IDs which we created. So that's where we create the XML file. So uh, that's it for today. Uh, today I show you how we can create XML file using Boost Library. So thanks for watching and please subscribe if you like the video. Bye.